Now this is Deep ID, and I'm here to show you Full Count Baseball, the ultimate baseball board game. <sighs> we got the rule book, we got the marker to put on the scoreboard. <sighs> we got um, the rally cards, we got the away team pitcher cards, we got the away team batter cards. Um, we got the away, we got the home team pitcher card. <sighs> Home team batter card. You got, there's all 32 MLB teams. Um, here is the the board. It's awesome. We got the, the disc, see through disc. There's the outs. And you put the, the batter cards here. These are the batter disc cards. Let's start off the game. You, you, H team gets two rally cards. There's a dice as well. Dice. Rollable. <laughs> um, and there's the cards here. The, um, so, a lot of people had trouble putting these on. I should say I did. So you have to put like your, like your thumbnail through it, and then like t thumbnail to open it up to put this in. Uh, you just have two rally cards, and then you decide who is the home team or the away team. So I put Cubs the away team, Four Niners the away team. Cubs my favorite team. Four Niners, I mean. Giants are my enemies. So I'm going to. Okay. So obviously the away team starts the bat first. So you have these cards to choose from. And I'm going to choose contact hitter. So you put that over here. That's where you're going to put it. Or it doesn't matter where you put it. I'm just going to put I just put it there. And then the pitcher chooses. I'm just gonna choose. I don't care this card. So you do is so you find slider on this, and you see what happens. Slider ground out base runners events one. So Cubs, this would be on the. This is the way side, and they go this way still, and then the way and the home team goes, which is dumb, and they just go all that way. So there, uh, advance one. So advance is one. You go and then put another Cub on bat. And there's also a double play card. There is a intentional walk. When you play intentional walk, or the double play, or the triple play, you take them out of the game immediately. Even if they success or success, or even if they're successful or not, you put them out the side. An intentional walk, it just it just go it just a walk. Um, so you do that, and then for the batter, when you use your batter card, you put them in a discard pile. So what happens is, uh, and that's not in your hand anymore. So then what, this is in your hand, but then the discard pile is not in your hand. So, um, you don't, you kind of play until you got three outs, and at the same time you don't. Because whenever your hand is gone, you switch, you switch to the other team, is the other team time to bat. So it's kind of weird, like, you might get two outs and you just might finish this whole thing before you get three outs. So then you just switch. It's kind of weird, like, that way. It's kind of the downside about this game, but this is a pretty good, fun, good game. So whenever you play this, it, it tells you on top when you can play it. Well, so, well, it, it shows when you can really play it, and you this steel base, you place before you play this. So you can't be, oh, I'm going to do this. You can't do that. You have to do, after you put all these, the discard pile, and the pitcher cards do not go to the discard pile. They stay with you, and there's no to put your discard pile anyway. You do that, and then I'm like, oh, no, I'm going to play this. So you put this over here, put that face up. You roll the dice, and the green is for Good for you. Red is for bad for you. So you roll this. Two. I uh, got two. Runners advance one. 
So the runners, this doesn't go vase, but this does. So he goes over there, and the pitcher did not catch him. But it was a red. It was a caught ceiling. Runner out. Um, there's also the super rally cards that just make you draw more. Or the other opponent draw more. Uh, so you keep doing that for a while. So you have nine innings. So the game it goes to either five innings or nine innings. And it goes to, and in this game it's only three balls and two strikes. So there's no um four balls and three strikes. It's three balls and two strikes. Uh so then when you're doing that, you do put that over. And then at the end of the at the end of the inning, you draw one super rally card. Both of you. <laughs> okay. So you have the marker you can put on here, the team, and then team, you can do that. that. So there is all 32 MLB teams, as I said. Uh, I don't think what I was going to say. Oh, yeah. Okay. So this game... It's a very fun baseball game. I think this is my favorite baseball game, and I think this is my only ba yeah my only baseball game. Plus, this is my favorite sports game I have. I don't know about my favorite game I have, but my favorite sports game I have. I think it's really fun. I think this is enjoyable for everyone. I think everyone should play this game. This game is a super not. Quick, I was gonna say it's quick, but like it's not super long, it just takes like 30 minutes 25 30 minutes depends on. But if you're like new to the game, it might take a little longer, it might take like 40 minutes. But that is uh, this is me, Deep ID, and uh, this is my game, How to Play Full Count Baseball. Have a good day.